there's this phenomena called the binomial effect size display that can help you understand what, like, in an embodied sense, what the magnitude of a correlation means. So here's how it works. Imagine that you have a predictor of 0 0.20. So the correlation is R equals 0 0.20 between um, phenomena 1, we'll say conscientiousness, and phenomena 2, workplace performance, 0 0.20 correlation. The question might be, well, how much, how much would you improve your predictive capacity over chance levels if you applied that predictor? And the answer is that the R is the difference between the odds ratio. So let me explain that. So 0 0.50, 0 0.50. If you subtract one from the another, you get 0. So the predictive validity of selection by chance is 0. 0 0.50 minus 0 0.50 equals 0. That's the predictive validity of chance. If you have a predictor of 0 0.20, which is approximately, that's sort of the low end estimate for conscientiousness, then that would change your odds ratio from 0 0.50, 0 0.50, right, random, to 0 0.60, 0 0.40, because 0 0.60 minus 0 0.40 is 0 0.20. And so the correlation coefficient turns out to be the, the difference between the odds, between the odds. So, and so it gives you a quick rule of thumb. So for example, so if you have a 0 0.20 predictor, that gives you 60-40. If you have a 0 0.30 predictor, that gives you 65-35, because 0.65 minus 0.35 is 0 0.30. And if you have a 0.6 predictor, which is really up on the high end, right? You're really starting to push your, the limits of statistical predic prediction validity at that point. That gives you 0 0.80 minus 0 0.20. And so what you've done, if you use a predictive a, a, a predictor that has a correlation coefficient of 0 0.60, which you could get, for example, if you took conscientiousness and combined that with a good test of IQ for predicting complex jobs, you might be able to get up to 0.6. That moves your odds ratio of selecting an above average person for the position from 0 0.50, 0 0.50 to 0 0.80, 0 0.20. So it cuts your, your failure rate by more than half, right? Brings it down from 0 0.50 to 0 0.20 because 0 0.80 minus 0 0.20 is 0 0.60. So that's a really good thing to know. That's called the binomial effect size display. It's a really good thing to have in your mind. It's very simple, it's just, a, it's just subtraction. And it, it gives you some sense of the power of, of, of statistical prediction.